Welcome back to this Red Dead Redemption 2 series. This will be part 11. Make sure to leave a like. Strawberry, if you could just guide me back. Well, I think that's where I'm already going, so might as well. I think of a good reason to say no. Oh, thank you, thank you, sir. Okay. Well, after you, what possessed me to come out here, I'll never know. <laughs> Alright, are you gonna get on the horse or. Alright, I guess I have to salute him. Yeah. Out here anyway. Clearly ain't your natural habitat. I uh, no, I'm just visiting. Uh, I, I'm from New York City, actually. You don't say. Oh, yes. There was some talk at the country club about this burgeoning little resort town called Strawberry. So I thought it might be quite the trip to see what all the fuss was. Perhaps make a few investments while it was still undervalued. Turns out I was made the fool. Not enjoying it, then? It's a town of splinters, if you could call it much of a town at all. I'd hardly stepped off the carriage and I'd taken in the whole place. I suppose some might call it charming. <laughs> Let me tell you, charm is not worth much these days. You show me a timber frame shack and I'll show you Broadway. And meanwhile you have this mayor, a quite intolerable blowhard. A little bespoke woodwork and he thinks this is a cultural hub? The man's completely deluded. Well, I should give him some credit. He must be quite the salesman. He did get me out here after all. More fool me. Now I'm tromping through the leaves in the muck with some cowboy. Uh, no, no offense. Little taken. Sir, you've rescued me from the depths. You seem quite the resourceful sort, sir. If for some reason you plan to spend any time in Strawberry, you may want to look into that gabbing mayor. Something is definitely off with him. All right, I'll keep that in mind. Yep. Hello, sir. I've uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the trail of a dangerous gang, Colm O'Driscoll. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got in a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mix, so maybe them's your boys. You can look right enough when we hang them. Thank you, sir. Let me out of here, you maggots! Arthur! Arthur! Hello, old friend. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> you gonna get me out of here? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh, I ain't joking, cowpoke. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months. And now, I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. Well, you gotta do something. Why? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. <laughs> Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people wanting to see you swing. You got to do something, Arthur. Got any dynamite? I think coming down here, pretty sure that's a winch, so I'm just gonna hook that up. Yep, okay. Yes! Hook that over the bars. See if you can pull them off. What a modern disaster this is gonna be. Just pull that lever. Come on. The security used to be terrible back in the old west. Why would you just have a big, like, grappling hook that's right next to the jail? That's okay. Makes no sense, but hey. Ugh! <sighs> 
Let's get out of here. Come on. What the hell are you doing? He wasn't O'Driscoll. All right, but put the mask on so they don't recognize me. You know, I've already been in the sheriff's office. All right, uh, headshot. Oh, there we go. Okay, this. Okay, there's gonna be. Yeah, literally the whole town's gonna come in after us, so it's gonna be pretty hard. All right, I'm getting feast on all of them. I'm about to die. There you go. Hopefully, the mic actually does something, so I don't. I don't have to kill like literally everybody. You know. That's how most teams are in campaigns. Your teammates won't do anything. I got some unfinished business. Trust me, Morgan. Trust you. You have finally lost your damn mind. Okay, I'm pretty sure we're going the wrong way here. They were supposed to be going that way, not this way. I want to get a huge ass. Get the hell out of you. That's all I want to do. He's got y'all on the porch. I'm trying to get these headshots. He hit in the body. It takes like three or four bolts to get him down. So I always aim for those heads. Oh, they're coming across the bridge. Okay, this mic could do is actually doing something. That's that's great. Let's go. Where are we going? Making a house call. There's more of these morons. We really should get out of here. Calm yourself, woman. Like I said, I need to see someone. Skinny! Get out here! Skinny! You always was a let down, you fat sack of crap. Excuse me a minute, Arthur. Hello, Maddie. Jesus Christ, what this dude's freaking insane. They had something of mine. My guns. I showed him, and I'll show the rest of this town! You have really lost it this time. And I gotta get some cover. Okay, not a tree stump, but I'll take it. I'm trying to get behind this box thing. Oh, look at this guy run off. Oh, thank God. Come on, sit. Come on, cover. Okay, I guess I can't take cover behind that box, I guess. Jesus. Alright, I guess I can hide behind this rock. Okay, where's where's you at? I need to get where's my horse? You wanna get out of here, don't ya? Oh, there we go. First kill cam of the mission. Let's get to those horses, Morgan. Finally, it's about time. Alright, I gotta calm down a little bit. Reckon it's time we got out of here, Morgan. Now you wanna get out of here. Oh man, okay. Make sure I'm, I'm trying to shoot the horse. I'm just trying to. Oh, I shot the horse. I'm not trying to shoot the horse. I'm just trying to shoot the people on top of the horse. How many people live in that town? I swear, there's only like seven buildings in the entire town. Oh, I think I just ran that guy over. Yeah, I have to shoot behind screen a little tough. Never mind. is clear. Who was that fella? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't end well. 
I saw how it goddamn ended. You was gonna let me hang. I'm starting to wish I had. And you owe Lenny, too. If he hadn't found us in time... Yes, you will all be thanked profusely, I promise. Yeah, well, you're lucky Dutch has got your back. For some unknown reason. Oh. I think we finally lost him. Well, I hope so. I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. And thank you. There I was, having a dull day only for you. To liven it up by letting me help you shoot up <laughs> half a town. You're a funny fella, Arthur. Real funny. <clears throat> why you act all sour all yeah, the time. Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court jester? All right, listen. I'm sorry, but we're family now. Arthur, you and me. <clears throat> Sons of Dutch. Makes us brothers. <clears throat> Sometimes... Brothers make mistakes. I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back at Strawberry. Come see me. Maybe I can make things up to you. So you ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offering. <clears throat> Bye now. Yeah! Alright, I can wrap the video up here. Hope you guys enjoy, and always leave a like.